Hey boys and girls, welcome to Art Recycled with Mrs. Hallmeyer. Today we're gonna use our Sketches School app and we are going to learn about symmetry. So look at this picture of a butterfly, boys and girls. Here's what symmetry is. Imagine an imaginary line that goes down the middle of the butterfly. And if I draw one thing on one side of the butterfly, it gets flipped over that imaginary line down the middle of the butterfly to the other side and we see its mirror image. Now, symmetry doesn't always have to be realistic. If you look at this picture, this is just an abstract design where I drew squiggly lines and shapes, and I made it the same on both sides. We are going to use the symmetry tool in the Sketches School app. So if you have not already downloaded the Sketches School app from the self-service menu, look for the blue pen that points downward. Once you have that installed, open it up, click the yellow folder that's on that app, and then once you open that yellow folder, you will see a white drawing page with a plus. Tap that and now we're ready to go. So now that I'm on my blank drawing page, boys and girls, I wanna to get to the symmetry tool. So to get to the symmetry tool, you wanna to tap the three dots at the top of your screen. You're gonna see a menu bar pop up that has two triangles that surround a straight line. I'm gonna tap those two triangles and now look, they're on my page. That line that you see, we call the axis of symmetry or the line of symmetry. So now watch, I'm going to draw boys and girls. And when I draw something on one side, it is going to be flipped and also be drawn on the other side like this. So see that it's like there's another pen on the other side that's following my finger and drawing the same thing. So now I'm going to keep going through my drawing and try different things. I'm going to switch my brushes and colors and you'll see kind of how to do that too if you need a refresher. And boys and girls, I'm going to build my symmetrical image and then I'm going to show you how to save it to your iPad so you can upload it to Seesaw. Mm -hmm. So boys and girls, now that my picture is done, I wanna get a picture of this bear into my photos on my iPad. So the first thing you wanna do is get rid of that line going down the middle of your picture. Tap the three dots again at the top and tap the double triangles with the line and that will make that symmetry tool go away. Now there are two different ways you can take a picture of your art. The first way is to take a screenshot of it. So take your thumb, put it on the home button, that circle button on your iPad, and then take your finger and put it on the power button. And if you press them at the same time, your iPad will take a picture of whatever is on your screen. So that's way number one. Way number two to get a picture of this into your photos is to tap the square with the arrow pointing up at the top of your screen like that. And then boys and girls go ahead and touch save image. If you touch save image, that is going to save your art into your photos on your iPad. And it's the first one in the list here that you see with a black square. Now that my bear is in my photos, boys and girls, I just have to go into Seesaw, find this assignment, tap the green add response button, and then tap the upload button, the cloud with the arrow pointing up to go to my photos and put my photo of my art into my Seesaw assignment. Good luck and let me know if you have any technical difficulties.